Okay, here we are, post-it note sketches. I'm gonna do my best here to um, um, uh, do some quick sketches here on a post-it note, but I got my two-year-old son <laughs> who is uh, right there uh, beside me. So any moment now he's gonna be, he's playing right now with his cars, but he's gonna be bugging me here in a second, so. So here, here we go. I'm gonna do some uh, quick uh, sketching right here. Just to kind of lay out some uh, proportions and uh, I just kind of like doodling here. Great way to just uh, not get too serious. Do things on a post-it note is is uh, pretty cool only because you know you're not intimidated so much saying that ooh I gotta I gotta actually complete a really nice drawing. It's not about that, it's just about kind of staying loose and doing something uh, quick and easy. So, you don't want to put a lot of detail, you just want to be quick about it. Do that I do all the time. I always do something here in the background kind of indicate that there's either a building or um, trees or something like that. Boy, he's... My boy is, uh, he's going to town. <laughs> He's been playing with that car for like, uh, I don't know, it's the only car he, uh, truck he plays with. three-quarter view. This is really a, uh, this is probably one of the easier views to do aside from the profile view because it's, it's really, uh, you don't have to worry about the perspective, it's just drawing um, really just parallel, um, parallel lines here. So, you know, I'm going from, this is all parallel this way, and you're just basically taking this view and twisting it. Uh, to three-quarter view and really easy view to understand and interpret okay so these are going you know these go pretty you know pretty quick actually you know, I just spent a lot of time and box out your squares here and you can even go with a more dynamic view stuff can be in the shadow. Got a little bit of reflection from the trees that come to this side. And so this one is done. So now we got three quick sketches, right? 
and twist it, see what that looks like. But um, those are three, and then we'll finish off with uh, maybe a front view here. going to see that I draw a lot of Audi-ish <laughs> type cars because I tell you what man, Audi, <laughs> those guys are doing something right because they obviously understand good proportion and a strong stance on the road. So uh, the vehicles that Audi makes and designs, they have a strong presence. If you look at their vehicles and you're like, wow, you see them coming on the road, you know it's an Audi. There's uh, sorry about that uh, bump. It's my son moving around here and uh, <laughs> tipping the camera. You all right? Looks like he's okay. He's not saying anything. posted some of these already but um, we'll do some more work here in the future you know what's the uh, you know what kind of you what do you really get out of this by doing these post-it note sketches and you know, basically for me it's just quick uh, ideas and it takes away a lot of that fear factor like I was telling you about before is um, Anytime you start off with a really nice white sheet of clean sheet of paper, large sheet of paper, it's like, ooh, you know, I gotta fill that all up. And like I said, the intimidation thing, you get pretty intimidated when you start off with something that big, and this removes all of that. You know, you're just messing around here. Hope you enjoyed it, and uh, see you next time here on DrivenMavens.com.